Drivers calling for more safety measures after a driver was shot and killed last Friday. CMPD says a man is still on the run following suspected road rage altercation that killed Ethan Rivera. Today, the community gathered together to express their frustration over all of this. WCNC Charlotte's Jane Monreal went to the rally today. Jane, what are they asking for here? Fred, they are asking for protection. One bus operator went as far as to say they want a little dignity. Now, this is the site where Ethan Rivera was shot last week, and today it is the place for a day of action in support of bus operators. All of the cast community mourns the loss of fallen bus operator Ethan Rivera. We are asking you to join us now in a moment of silence. Dozens of bus operators as well as friends of the transit community say they're tired of being silenced when it comes to the fear they face every day when they show up for work. We moved this city and for us to be treated the way we're treated, it's unacceptable. Friday, their voices heard with clothing and signs bearing the message, I am Ethan. They said, uh, let's meet at the place and have a conversation. And so, uh, what I'm doing is I'm just trying to set the stage for those conversations. Michelle Dunlap Thompson, a former operator, says enough is enough. She says it's due time that city leaders put in place more security measures, including security officers on nightly bus routes and bulletproof partitions on each bus. It heightened already pre-existing fear. Um, it heightened the fear in the lives of their families. It heightened the fear in the lives of this community. It is not just the operator's safety that we need to be concerned with. It is the safety of the riders as well. Stand up for what's right for Ethan. Ethan was your co-worker. Ethan was your brother. Ethan was your family. Ethan was yours. The cats said in a statement today that they were aware of today's demonstration, but at the same time, they are talking, continuing to talk to union representatives. In the meantime, today's group said while the gathering today was not a protest, it is the beginning of a conversation in their movement to improve the safety and security of bus operators and that they will not be going away and that this is just the beginning. We are live in Uptown, Jane Monreal, WCNC Charlotte. Jane, thank you.